It's got an aluminum chassis, immersion resistance, and a brand famous for making tractors. That's pretty cool. I'm Michael Fisher. This is Pocket Now. This is the B-15 from Caterpillar, and we got some work to do. Let's unbox it. As you can see, folks, this is going to be an authentic unboxing with the bubble wrap still on the box. I have not laid eyes on what's inside, so while we get through the bubble wrap, we will throw a quick thank you to our friends at clove.co.uk who provided us with this demo unit. Visit them for your smartphone needs. Now that that bubble wrap is out of here, we can see the uh, yellow and black branding of many, many durable devices that have gone before. This is kind of the, uh, the default color scheme when you want to indicate your device is bad and lean and mean and in charge and all that kind of stuff. This is just some copyright information here uh, detailing the use of the CAT brand. We had a look at this device actually at MWC in uh, Barcelona uh, and where we were told that it was made by, uh, obviously not made by Caterpillar itself, made by another company and, uh, and branded as CAT. Let's see if we can just pop the device off the top of this box off right here. And there it is. Interesting. Uh, no big surprise to see the phone couched front and center, but uh, certainly interesting to see it encased in this sort of faux velvet packaging here. Let's take this sucker out of the box. It's a fairly lightweight device coming right out of its cradle there. You can see some fingerprints on the screen, so maybe we're, uh, we're second wave on this. Maybe another outlet had a look at this first. That's okay. First time I'm seeing it. Let's pop up in the cradle here. Let's see what's inside here. <laughs> If this is the user manual, oh, it is. This is awesome. Check that out. That's one of the cooler user manuals I've seen. Obviously, it's in the shape of the device. <laughs> well done, Caterpillar. You have amused me. So maybe we'll take a look at that. That's the first user manual I, uh, I've considered actually reading in a very, very long time. This would appear to be uh, some instructions for removing the battery door. That's handy to have. This is a uh, European power adapter, of course. Da -da -da -da. There's our USB cable. Now this is, uh, what is this, a mounting bracket? Maybe this has something to do with the instructions we just saw earlier. I'm not really sure. Ah, uh, here's the battery, which explains why the device was so light. Do we have a milliamp hour rating on this? Yes, we do indeed. It is a 2000 milliamp hour battery included with the unit. Come back out. Some headphones in the box, another surprise. These. Uh, some people like us to take the headphones out of the box so we can actually see what they are. Yeah, <laughs> no foam on these. They just go right into your ear canal and, uh, and love falling out, but uh, whatever, it's still nice to see them there. This kind of recalls uh, Blackberry toggles of, of yore with this little chrome thing. Didn't necessarily expect to see earbuds on a durable phone. Rest of the box is empty and the rest of the packaging is just completely barren. Cat really going for simplicity there. And let's see if we can figure out how to take the battery cover off. There's an unlock switch right there. We slide to unlock and maybe we, maybe we pry this sucker off. There we go, that's how we do that. We'll stick the battery right in. Replace the back cover to preserve the device's immersion resistance. Now this is rated to IP67 for immersion in water. It's also got these, this is actually aluminum here, slightly cool to the touch. Volume rocker there. Uh, what is this? A USB port is off to the side here, protected by a rubber gasket. And the headphone port up top is similarly protected. Looks like a three and a half millimeter jack there, as it should be. There's power standby. And why don't we go ahead and try and press that power standby button, see if we can get some, some life out of this unit here. There we go. There's a cat splash screen. First of, first of my career, certainly. Maybe it won't be the last. We will have to see. I do want to remind everyone we will not be uh, doing a full review on this device, but we are going to do a video feature on it. Um, the cat is calling out, in addition to its IP67 certification, the aluminum body, the toughened rubberized casing is what it calls it, with minimal openings. That's uh, Corning Gorilla Glass up front there. We got a low battery warning there, and there's that almost stock Android build right there. Uh, it's Jelly Bean 4.1 is what it ships with here. So. This is your quick look at the hardware of the CAT B15 following the first Caterpillar unboxing of Pocket Now's history. Certainly hope you enjoyed it. Once again, we want to thank our friends at clove.co.uk for sending us the CAT B15 demo unit. And please stay tuned for the feature video covering this device coming very, very shortly. In the meantime, though, like us if you enjoyed the video. Leave us a comment below if you have a question or a suggestion for the next one. 
follow us on social media. And thank you, as always, for watching. We'll see you next time.